Chancellor of Don Bosco, as in our charism, there is always the intention to help as many young people as possible, especially poor ones, and I am very happy for this collaboration partnership we have with BINA, because it is thanks to their own support that we uh, uh, been able in these past years to uh, been able to realize this plan, this project of ours, which is very dear to us. In our school for the past three years, we have been running a short course programs that has been assisted by donors who have been helping us to run these programs for the young people of our time. So far, we have different projects running, but as I said, for the past three years, we are running three months courses in and three months out. So in all, we have six months training for our young people where they get training on hands-on. That means we do more of the practicals than the theory. Basically, we enroll students for at least 25 or 30 in a class and then we take them through some basic training um, in automobile. We give them hands-on skills in auto electrical, vehicle layout, um, suspension system, lubrication system, oil changes, transmission system, lighting system, chassis ignition system. This is what we do within this few three months here at Don Bosco. And then um, we've enrolled about um, 30 students in each three months. So total we are having about like 355 students that has passed through our hands for automobile training and we really appreciate the effort Bina has put into this youth. Through this Bina project, I can now work on uh, vehicles, as example, changing of lubrication, uh, braking system, the lighting system, the ignition system. At first, I did not know what is an lubrication system. But through our good facilitators, I have no what is a lubrication system. That simply means changing of oil. Through the course, it has helped me a lot and get the opportunity to work in Toyota Ghana. And I'm urging my friends who are also outside there doing the automobile to put their effort in going to help them a lot. Through the BINA project, I got the chance to work here. Currently, I'm at um, Toyota Tissue Manufacturing Ghana, TTMG. Here we assemble cars. And it's through the project I got the chance to be here. So I encourage everyone out there to grab this opportunity. And um, I also want the BINA project to continue going and um, for others to also enjoy this opportunity I'm having now. It's, it's, it's a life-changing opportunity for everyone. And, I pray it's continuous and for the past three years we have trained about 350 students. I actually heard about Don Bosco from a friend. She came giving me a form to apply for Don Bosco if I really wanted to dig into the beauty industry. And I just took the chance to come here. I actually chose to do beauty care because I loved it and I was kind of practicing it at home. So I chose to come and then learn more in the professional ways of doing it. I'm very grateful because really uh, um, the targets that BINA itself had at the beginning of this project were achieved, which are targets which fit also our own uh, uh, plans, our own uh, projects. Uh, more than 2,000 young people have been benefiting from this project and uh, the, the extension of this project in, for other uh, four months will allow us to benefit some more young people. Not only because of the training received, but also because of the job opportunities they had at the end of the project. After completing as a first batch, a lot of projects we have gained with, uh, with our client and so on, we are still on it. 
and more is still on board to do. So this school has helped us a lot and we are aiming a lot to and our life has been transformed we hope and we are pleading with the management board to still continue with this school and also to help our junior brothers who are yet to come. Don Bosco as a religious institution we try as much as possible to touch the holistic aspect of the individual. For Don Bosco, education is the matter of the heart, and therefore the training of the individual should really touch the heart of the person. And touching the heart of the person, we cannot leave the religious aspect of it. And that is why Don Bosco becomes unique. As a Tibet center, we try as much as possible to be unique among the other institutions across the country. We've realized that within the three years, out of the more than 400 students we've trained, it has helped them that because we help the less privileged. Some of them have finished the basic school, whom they have nothing to do, but through this basic training we've given them, now 50% of them are working on their own and an industry has taken most of them, giving them employment and they are doing very well. Through this project, I have learned how to prepare continental dishes and local dishes as well. I must say that it's a credit for us helping the less privileged in Ghana. program is very good to us. It helped the community and everybody in large, especially Tatale. We enjoy the program very well and students are still calling to come. People are willing to come. This program is really helping it's really helping a lot in terms of job creation, direct job, and it's also helping students to also start their career because some of these guys finish SHS and then they don't know what really they'll be doing next. So they come here and then they see the opportunity and then they use this to start another career or to create a career for themselves. Before I enrolled on this program, I was actually working with a company, but a friend introduced me to the program. Already, I've been very interested in building some technical skills. So hearing the opportunity, I thought it was the right time for me to enroll onto the program. And honestly, within three months, I've been able to learn so much on this BINA program. I was a past student of this school and I actually benefited from the program a lot. After I completed, I had so many encounters project on house wiring, domestic installation, and so many other activities. I had an opportunity to come back and then teach my colleague genius. By then I completed my technical education at the tertiary level and I was not employed. But through this BINA program, I have been able to get a job and which has helped myself and my family at large. Hospitality is the art of kindness and looking after the basic needs of a customer or strangers in relation to food, accommodation and drinks. So far they are really doing excellent. It's not easy though at the first beginning but getting into the program they realize what they are missing and they put themselves, their hearts, their knowledge into what they are doing. So now, how do you identify? You see, like this one is a start, this one is a combo, this one is a round. Since the refrigeration industry, the demands are more, and the ladies are also coming in more now. That is the job opportunity for this food is viable. I decided to choose refrigeration and air conditioning because I know it will benefit me in my future. And since I came here, 
What I experienced in refrigeration and air conditioning is that as I was in the house, I don't know anything about air conditioning, but as I'm standing here, I can do so many things about refrigeration and air conditioning. I can install air conditioning, do wiring in both indoor and outdoor units, and repair iron, gas cooker, heater, rice cooker, and other things. Refrigeration is very interesting. And when you find yourself in refrigeration and air conditioning department, you always smile at all times. We would be very much happy to continue this collaboration uh, since there are several elements which may uh, be consistent between our own goals and the goals of BINA. We try to complete this project uh, the best as we can and try to help as many people as possible with this project and then we wait for a, maybe a project which may uh, have some slightly different targets but which may allow us to still benefit uh, young people and especially poor young people.